so in previous slides lectures i several several times i used distributed system but you might not have any idea about what is distributed system so in this lecture i am going to give you some idea about what is distributed system to speak in general terms distributed system is nothing but multiple computer systems are working on a single problem or multiple computes or you know nodes working on a single problem this is in general terms or layman terms so in engineering terms a distributed system is a network that consists of independent computers that are connected using a distribution middleware so there are few key features of the distributed system those are nothing but components in the distributed system are concurrent they will work all together and it also allows resource sharing including software by systems connected to the network at the same time and also the components could be multiple but will generally be autonomous in nature the systems can be spread across different geographies so few nodes can be in india few nodes can be in japan and few nodes can be in usa compared to other network models there is a greater fault tolerance in a distributed model so whenever some nodes will go down still our other nodes can continue to work or provide the service and the one more thing is and price per performance ratio is much better in distributed systems which means with a lower price you can get better performance and the key goals of a distributed systems include transparency nothing but so hiding the complexity of the system and showing just the functionality or itself as a single unit so that is transparency and next thing is reliability compared to a single system a distributed system should be highly capable of being secure consistent and high capability of masking errors and the next thing is performance compared to other models this distributed models are expected to give a high performance or boosted performance and the last thing is scalability distributed systems should be scalable with respect to geography and also size it means so if you use more number of nodes then definitely we can scale that so along with this one we also have few challenges in distributed systems they are nothing but security is a big challenge in these kind of systems especially when we are using public clouds or public network fault tolerance could be tough when this model is built based on unrealistic or unreliable component coordination and resource sharing could be difficult if proper protocols are policies are not included so in the next slide we will see more about coordination challenge